Many people are making their way to Kansas City to support their teams in the Big 12 tournament. But basketball isn't the only thing people are getting excited about. With KSNT News reporter Randy Garcia is live in Kansas City to tell us what else is stealing the show. Randy. Jace, people have been lining up all day here at Joe's Barbecue to get a taste of this legendary Kansas City barbecue. And for fans coming in from out of town, this is one pit stop they had to make while in KC. Michael Alexio flew in from Virginia for the Big 12 tournament. The University of Kansas alum says a trip to Kansas City wouldn't be complete without getting Joe's Barbecue. I graduated medical school in 1996. That was the first year that Oklahoma Joe's opened. I've been coming here every time I come back to Kansas City since. Just like Michael, many other fans stopped in to take part in the Kansas City tradition, which started in the early 1900s. It's getting to be a pretty big event down at Sprint Center and brings a lot of different fans from the different colleges, you know, here to, locally to Kansas City and they all want to participate in, uh, you know, the local barbecue trend. Taylor says they prepare well to feed all the hungry fans in town for the tournament. We just make sure we schedule heavily and we just start cooking food you know, they're towards the, the end of last week, and our smokers are pretty much run 24 7 this week, just trying to keep up. Joe's, Gates, and Arthur Bryan are favorites among more than 100 barbecue restaurants across the metro. Add in basketball, and you have two fan favorites. I think it has definitely turned into Big 12 and barbecue. And they're even having a barbecue competition outside the Sprint Center during the Big 12 tournament. So it's safe to say barbecue has become a part of the Big 12 experience here in Kansas City. Live in KC, Raina Garcia, KSNT News. All right, thank you, Raina. It is true. Joe's Kansas City, they're very popular. If you haven't had their Z Man, you want to try that one. Now, on the court tonight's matchup, it includes TCU versus Oklahoma State, and West Virginia is taking on Oklahoma.